we stop to think about the history of missionaries, we see that over the years, thousands of people have given their lives to follow Jesus. In attempts to reach out to the unevangelized, many courageously ended up losing their lives. Have we all had the courage to proclaim Christ in all circumstances? This is the question of the Holy Father. The Word of God cannot be given as a proposal. Well, if you like it, or like a good philosophical or moral idea, well, you can live it this way. No, it's something else. It needs to be proposed with this frankness, with this force, so that the Word penetrates to the bone, as Paul says. The Word of God must be proclaimed with this frankness, with this force, with courage. In the same reflection, Pope Francis emphasizes the profile of one who preaches the Word of God and what kind of proclamation must be made. The person who doesn't have courage, spiritual courage, courage of heart, who is not in love with Jesus. And from there comes courage. No, you will say, but something interesting, something moral, something that will do you good, a good philanthropy. But this is not the Word of God. And this is incapable, this Word, of forming the people of God. Only the Word of God, proclaimed with this frankness, with this courage, is capable of forming the people of God. Benedictus vos omnipotens Deus, Pater, Filius, Spiritus Sancti. Amen. Amen.